Hey guys, it's my review, short review, TC Pro Hunter FX. It's not an encore, so you cannot change barrels. Please be aware of that before you buy one. And uh, I'm doing this with one hand, so sorry. But uh, you got Speed Breach 3 in here, which is you can turn it three times, three full rotations, and uh, comes out. And just uses 209s, so it's other muzzle loaders. Put a cheapy mossy oak sling on there. And uh, standard TC range rod, or not range rod, but uh, just standard aluminum rod. Williams fiber optic sights on here. And uh, 209 by 50 Magnum. Thompson Center. Pro Hunter FX fixed action. And uh, I don't have scope mounts on there yet. Uh, some major changes, they do not have the full wrap around here, I don't know if you can see that, for your grip on your flex deck stock. And uh, actually inside this stock is filled up with um, purple, or not purple, pink foam. Interesting note there. And uh, it's really hard to clean inside here because you can't take the barrel off. You can take the fore end off but not the barrel. So. I just put some number 13 TC uh, solvent down there. Works out pretty well. Try and one handedly take off this breech plug. And uh, look down the barrel. Got this used at Cabela's for. I believe it was 400 plus tax and uh, some guy returned it didn't like it I guess didn't clean it but it got sent back to TC they checked it all you know fine still haven't shot it yet cleaned it up though and uh, haven't seen any reviews online so I was hoping maybe I could help somebody out here good gun might want to triumph I don't know Personally, I like this one. The hammer seems a little bit more steady, a bit more like reliable, I guess you could put it. And uh, these flex tacks right here, sometimes you can push them if you really torque on them. So, I mean, I got one of them was pushed in by took a screwdriver on the other side and uh, pulled it out and then put it back in. But nothing big. I mean, you really have to torque on that thing to push it in. Limb saver recoil pad, all the standard Pro Hunter stuff. There's no logo on the side. It just says FX on this side. I don't know if you can read that there. FX. No Pro Hunter or Encore logo. It's not an Encore, so. And, uh, yeah. Only one ramrod holder in outside of the stock at the forehand. Compared to the Encore, it has two. But it really doesn't matter to me. It doesn't really make a difference. Um, that's about it. Subscribe, whatever. Don't really, I mean, I don't really put in that many videos. But either way, I'll be sure to upload some hunting videos this fall. Thanks.